Well, hello there. This is uh, Robert from Pub Kicks. And uh, I've been getting a lot of uh, comments regarding about uh, my setup uh, with uh, McPrim. So we'll go ahead and uh, answer that uh, because I want everybody to be happy with uh, Supreme this year. So if you have not seen my live cap on uh, on McPrim, uh, go ahead and uh, watch it. I think it's gonna be right here so the info card is right here go ahead and play that and uh, you can go ahead and see uh, what happened there <clears throat> so let's go with the setup here guys all right uh, a lot of people are asking me how do you set up your mic frame and uh, we'll, we'll go ahead and uh, ta ta I'll, I'll talk to you guys about this okay so let's say for example you have multiple cards so you already put in uh, uh, the purse uh, profile under your name so let's not we're not talking about like what you already have we're gonna talk about what you're gonna have you know the the other cards okay so this is how i uh basically uh change up my address and and all the information so this is a secret okay don't tell anybody about this but this is a pub kick secret but i will tell you guys since you guys are watching this right now and I really thank you for that. But by the way, go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you have not done it yet. And go ahead and hit that like button as well. So anyway, uh, we'll name this as, uh, let's say, uh, uh, I don't know, uh, my other card or whatever you want to name your profile name. And then you go ahead and type in your name here, you know. Pub. so let's say uh, my name is pub kicks you don't type that don't do that guys don't do it okay look for your mom's name so my mom's name is Pobi pobiana kicks however the last name go ahead and change it up a little bit so we'll put Fabiana Kiksua for email address uh, go ahead and just enter another email address in there as well uh, it doesn't matter uh, if it's a gmail or a catch all it will work uh, that's what I've been doing I've just been using a catch all email address so we're gonna go ahead and put uh, you know Miss, Mrs. Pubkicks at catch all at com. so let's say my house let's go with this so let's say my house is 1400 uh 1400 uh st louis drive and that's a house let's say it's already a house okay so we'll go ahead i'll go ahead and fill out this information okay and uh, i will tell you guys here on what to do uh, so telephone number is 808 uh, 466 seven six five whatever <laughs> so your phone you will not type your real phone number here guys so uh make sure that you just put another phone number in here uh it doesn't matter if it's not real uh however uh just be remindful of when you use this as a profile for an in-store sign up that you make sure that you change the phone number later but as far as or you can make another uh you can make another uh profile for in store so just to make sure that you receive the text message when you're doing in store sign up uh however so just put up any random phone number in there um i don't know uh, nine uh, whatever uh zip code uh honolulu whatever your address is just go ahead and put that in there um so here we are so let's say this is your this is what your original profile looks like all right um now what you're gonna do with the additional one so we're gonna go ahead and change things up here so with this i would do this i would do i would put drive or i would do saint spell it out or i can do saint with two t's 
as long as it's kind of different from the other ones uh, that's what you do with changing address now let's say you have six cards under your name so you're gonna make six additional profile okay and make sure that every single billing address is kind of different uh, and if you have a house you can actually put apartment one or apartment a it's endless you can put apartment 1360 54 you know or you can even put that in here see that oh that's pretty good but make sure you change the name every time make sure the email address is different as well every time and the phone number as well every single profile that you have make sure that it's all different now you might say but mr pub kicks the card is named after me now here is the secret guys it doesn't matter <laughs> you can put whatever name you want as long as the zip code is the same as the billing address ah i got you on that one huh that's pretty good that's pretty cool uh, information to have so we'll go you just go ahead and do that guys uh and you know like the the season is early so you can go ahead and try that but uh it has worked for me here time and time and again uh i use i use people's name uh you know and make sure make maybe maybe your last name is uh owens right uh and then just make up a new name make up a new name new name new name owens doesn't matter you can put that in there it's a name as long as the zip code is the same as your billing however so let's say also now let's say uh but mr pop kicks i do live in an apartment i live in apartment two what am i gonna do so again the same thing you know the billing address make sure it, it's a bit different you can do apartment two you can do unit two you can do number two and then you can all you can always do this as well so let's say you're not your apartment for unit two you need 2a oh my goodness look at that boom boom that's already a win this year so make sure you do that guys uh as long as the zip code is the same as your billing uh as your card number you will be good to go so make sure you do that that's 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 the, that's the most important part is uh, you know like that's that's you're you're already winning half the battle here I'm already giving you all this information so make sure you do that but just make sure the name is different the email is different the phone number is different and you change some of the spelling oh another thing that you can do too maybe maybe you only the thing is with the uh with supreme they will not judge you if you only finish you know poor poor grade so maybe st louis you type it st like that because you're you know because your eyes are not really that well and you just mistype it doesn't matter it's still gonna go to your address you see that guys like there's plenty of things that you can do <clears throat> uh about your address here with your billing address so you can just change it up a little bit here uh you know as long as it kind of resolves your original address it doesn't matter um you know um but yeah that's mainly the thing here uh as long you can you can actually a little bit misspell it uh and it will, it will still ship to your house and uh i've done that already so you don't have to uh you know worry about it so let's go ahead and with task setup here guys so with task setup here uh you know for mic prim um one of the thing here is the maximum browser task number is up here uh, that number is actually based on uh, your computer capability so people's number will be different than other people if your computer is either uh, a lot stronger or maybe you you have uh, one of those old ones and you will only have you will only see about maybe five or ten so that's the recommended maximum number uh, this uh, the, the bot will not even care if you make uh 100 browser task 
but it's how much your computer will be able to handle so that's what they're recommending right here all right so that's what it is okay so let's go ahead and make a task here for example so this is how i make a task okay so task name you know i just i don't know i don't even know why this is asking me what my task name is however what i do is i just put in you know like week one or whatever uh, uh just in case uh i need it later but i that's what i do it's like every week i just change it up so for profile uh we'll go ahead and uh, use rick here for example so the keyword will always have a plus or minus so let's go let's say we're gonna go for the air force one so let's go plus nike now here is the thing about proxies guys uh, as long as you're not running a server, uh, you can use your local host. Uh, you can use up to, I would not recommend it, however, uh, my recommendation would be three maximum, but you can actually go up to five, uh, you know, for a short time. But uh, what I suggest is, let's say, for example, I really want Air Force One. What I'm going to do is I'm going to run local host because that usually goes through a lot faster than the other. So let's say I really want this. So I'm going to go with local host here, guys. So category, uh, you know, uh, we'll go with shoes because this is a pair of shoes. <laughs> uh, make sure that you check with your Discord group or whatever the suggestion is uh, right before the drop and make sure that you correct everything. So with color, you just type in, uh, you can leave it random if you want random color. Or, uh, you know, like for me, I just want it white. So I just put white in there. And again, for the size, uh it's all you know different uh you know like uh, maybe uh, i'm a size 10 and a half so i'm gonna go with size 10 and a half for item quantity so here is the thing about make i make cream the cool thing about it is you can actually put eight and it will actually check out the maximum quantity that it has so let's say you can only check out two uh you, it will actually try to check out two uh even though you put eight in there so you know if you're doing accessories let's say for example like the zip lock bag or uh the pill it will actually try to check out the, the the maximum quantity that the website allows so that's pretty good right there <clears throat> now here we're gonna go with the mode so we're going to go back to quantity one because we, we all know that you can only check out one in there so might as well not have the bot try it out but yeah uh, so that's uh just put a little bit to one so with the mode here uh the first the very first time that i used make uh i didn't really read the guide on how to to use it uh i just went with browser safe because that's what i always do um with uh with make prim i mean uh, not so i'm sorry with the other bots i always just go with the most safer side uh just in case so i i usually do browser safe uh with checkout delay um since last season it's just a ticket system for some reason i just leave it to checkout delay to zero and it actually works so i leave it to zero and for some reason uh make prim just automatically automatically does it for me as far as what checkout delay should go now before the issue of captcha bypass uh you would check this but it doesn't work anymore so make sure that's off well you know you can leave this some some of them on as well uh retry on failure you will be turning it on uh, so when there's a failure on the task created uh, that will actually work and uh this is this this goes for the us guys so uh with europe i'm not really sure what uh uh, the cardinal and 3d uh, bypass do so so remember guys this is just for the us uh we don't really know what i don't really know what to use it for uh, when it comes to like the 3d bypass and cardinal bypass when it comes to europe but when i find out i'll go ahead and make sure uh, i tell you guys about that so that's pretty much it uh that's how you, that's how i create my task uh browser safe uh sometimes i do browser normal so make sure that when you are making a task, uh, when you're doing local host, make sure that you limit that on um, one to three tasks. No more than that because you don't want to get banned. Uh, now, people ask me like, uh, what do you do? So do you just leave it like that? Like uh, how many tasks do you make? Honestly, I make one task per profile, per item. 
so if this is my task for the shoes i just leave it like this and that's it that's it i don't make any more i don't i don't try to to do other things uh, I think it will slow down my computer uh, first of all. So I make sure that I, this is all I do. That's it. Um, but, but, you know, what you can do is for later, uh, after, after, you know, it's clear, um, I would, uh, this is what I do too. Uh, sometimes when I'm running for restock, you know, uh, what I would do is I would uh, make super and API task here. I just duplicate my task and do super or API <clears throat> uh, because it will not hurt you to run super or API uh, mode uh, but I found out that uh, for me uh, browser always works better so that's uh, that's what I do um, so you can run multiple API but uh, uh, from my experience uh, browser safe always works for me so let's say uh the time is already close to drop time and we're getting ready for this uh people say to 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 click both of this on uh honestly uh when i did that uh, and followed the guide uh, uh for some reason uh, i think that's the week that i did not get the bowl so i went back to my original setting of just uh doing it as release that's it no restock yet release so the first two minutes this is what i'm running and then when i once soon as i find out that some of the tasks did not go through i go ahead and switch it up oh look at that huh? it's like boom 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 but i don't turn it on at the same time uh i don't know for me it seems like it's a lot slower so uh but anyway you have these buttons right here so now what you're gonna do like uh so now it's closer to drop time you know i already got my release set up right here and about to uh, start the task here uh what i do usually is i leave it to 1000 monitor and then uh believe it or not uh right before drop time i do drop it to 500 and then i go boom boom 500 now, if you're running localhost, you are now risking of getting banned easier. Um, so, if you're not comfortable with that, I leave it again to 1000. Boom. That's it. Leave it like that. And this is how I do my task on the weekly. Uh, so, anyway, that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video like i said make sure that you hit that like button uh, go ahead and subscribe uh if you have any other questions uh, just let me know down in the comment or you can find me on twitter as well uh and a lot of you uh you guys can find me on discord as well uh, i think it's pretty obvious of what my name is on, on discord so uh just go ahead and look for me if you have any questions other than that uh, thank you for watching and i hope you like this video go ahead and hit that subscribe button again and uh, like that button if you do like this video and don't forget to leave a comment uh, thank you again for all the support kita kids